that little gold digger in her place, Alistair. You're wearing Ethan's ring, and you feel that you're deserving of... Wait a minute, Grandfather. No, you wait a minute, Ethan. I want to tell your fiancé one thing. Welcome to the family. What? What is Father up to? No. I want you to feel at home, Teresa. Here at the mansion, and at the new estate we'll build for you and Ethan after the wedding. It's almost time for the countdown. Oh. Uh, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, six five, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year. I'm glad you and Alistair are keeping your word about not breaking up Ethan and Teresa. I assure you, our word is our bond. Mm. Well, at least Ethan will have married for love. Oh, I almost forgot. I have something I want to show everyone. Come with me. They're all for you, Teresa. your ravens. Jimmy's never seen so many birds before. It looked like they were going to attack the Bennett house. Well, they're not here to ring in the new, that's for sure. But they're going to attack Jimmy's sweet journey. Oh, what will happen to her?
ever wanted. A man truly loved me as much as I loved him. Well, you have it now. You have me. And you have my heart. And you're gonna take good care of it, right? Always. <laughs> Happy New Year, Sheridan. Happy New Year. The happiest New Year of my life. Mine too. What's the hook? Why were you so nice to Teresa? Have you never heard the phrase, keep your friends close, but keep your enemies closer? Oh, yes, uh, of course I understand completely. I severely yes. doubt that, but no matter. Just know that we will split up not only Ethan and Teresa, but Luis and Sheridan as well, all in due time. Well, how will we pull that off? Will uh, Luis and Teresa die in an accident of some sort? <laughs> Possibly. But that might draw too much attention to the family. I'll think on it. Come up with some other way to destroy their lives and keep them away from the cranes forever. How did it come to this? Standing out here alone on New Year's. I hope Mother finds what she's looking for so she can come up with a way for me to win Ethan back soon. Here it is. A letter from Ivy to Sam telling him that he is Ethan's father. Ah! This is it! This is proof that Ethan is Sam Bennett's son! Ah! And armed with this information, Gwen and I will get everything that we want. No offense, Tabby. That was the most awesome display of evil Timmy's ever seen. And that's just the tip of the evil bird, Tim Tim. When Hecuba gets through with charity, harmony will never be the same. Destroy you! 